Hey guys, it's Miss Lacey, and welcome to your sketchbook project. This is step four of your sketchbook project, where you will be using the templates to cut the cereal boxes and create your cover boards. Okay, so now we're going to do step four, where we're actually going to cut our covers out of our cereal box. So you are going to need a pair of scissors, you're going to need your template, and you're going to need your cereal box. And a pencil. Forgot about the pencil. I'm going to use pen just because it's easier for you guys to see on the camera, but I do want you to use pencil. So you guys will notice that there's some folds here on the box and also here. We want to keep everything in the center, okay? So you're going to take your template that you cut and you can do it like towards the top so it, you know it's less of a cutting space that you have to do. Um, but you are going to hold it in place and trace it to the best of your ability. Okay, so there's my first template, or that's my first cover. So now I'm going to do the second one on the other side. Okay, so now I have my two templates, and I have to cut them out. So again, if you made your lines nice, cut on the outside of the lines just so since the template was a little bit smaller than it was supposed to be. Um, another thing to work smarter, not harder with cutting these out, don't leave flaps of the cereal box on. Like, Don't just turn now and cut this way. Cut it off so it's out of your way. It will make it easier for you. And you're going to take your time. You don't want there to be any sharp points on the edge of this. You want it to be a nice, nice and smooth. I might have to come back and cut that, fix the edge. Okay, and again, I'm going to just quickly cut down so I have less in my way now. So there's my first cover, okay? Now I'm going to cut the second one out. Okay, now one thing before you go to the next step. You need to make sure that your covers are the same size. So if you notice that one side is a lot larger than the other, um, you need to trim it down. So right now mine actually look great. So you can check by putting them on top of one another. Um, and if you can't see the one behind or vice versa, then you did a great job. Uh, before you put these away, always put your name on everything. That way nothing gets misplaced. Thank you.